but I try not to take advantage of the fact that I know that if I complain, he's gonna do it. All right, well, it's eight o'clock. If I'm gonna make it a class, I'm gonna have to hurry the hell up. Hello, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. I'm in the kitchen. Last night was a really good night because Mr. decided that he was gonna cook and everything, which was so amazing. And then um, I had, I think, three glasses of Taylor Port, which were amazing. I slept like a rock, like a log. All I know is I just slept. I should really make some smoothie, but am I in the mood to do that? Maybe not. I just bought some matcha powder on Amazon because the last couple of days I've been buying a matcha latte every couple of days. Last week I bought two, this week I bought one. We're not doing that. And so um, I bought the matcha powder so I can make matcha lattes at home. Um, but what I really came on here for is because this sink is literally full of dishes. And it's so ironic because yesterday I saw a TikTok where the lady went home and the sink was like full and she just started loading everything into the trash can. And for some reason, I literally feel like her right now because I literally hate when the sink is full of dishes, but it's full. I woke up at 6 a.m. because I said that I wanted to do like a little workout that did not happen and will not happen. So my pajamas are so cute. I got it from Shein. Anyways. I'm gonna do the dishes because it's kind of pissing me off. Throwing some hot water over these and I need to make some coffee. Now I'm somewhat downgraded to making decaffeinated coffee because of the caffeine and my body is not like, they're not working out. So I'm staying away from the caffeine, but I'm um, definitely having some decaf coffee. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of upset at Mr. right now because like why are there so many dishes in here? This is very upsetting and very triggering. When this man cooks, he literally uses every single thing that we own for the kitchen. I kid you not me. I'm one, washing as I go along. I'm two, not using that many stuff. I never have so many things in the sink when I'm done. And I feel like the fact that I was a bit inebriated and I wake up to these, it's pissing me off. It appears my hair is going to take a little bit longer to fix. I'm so mad about these dishes. Maybe I'll just get to class late. Because I'm going to fix my hair and I'm going to clean up this kitchen. But right now, i got to fix my hair first. So that by the time I'm done with everything else, it's ready. So I'll be back. Today. I'm finally done with my hair and I'm kind of annoyed at the moment. And I think later on we're going to be meeting up with friends for drinks. So I'm annoyed, I'm annoyed all over. So I feel like, uh, I feel like I'm going to end up just going late, honestly, because I'm going to make something to eat still. And I still have to clean up this sink. So we're going to do the dishes. And shower and stuff. I think I even want to change my bag. I'm not even, I don't know.
I feel like for a very long time I didn't realize that whether decaf or caffeinated coffee, you're gonna get the same coffee taste, but it's the kick that you get from the caffeine that you're not gonna get from the decaf, so. So because of that, for a while, I just didn't think that I could drink decaf because I'm like, oh, it's not gonna be the same thing. I also need to buy a kettle because at this point, this is very ghetto, all right? I need to buy a kettle. Damn, I cut my nails yesterday and they're rough. The issue with the kettle is that they're not aesthetically pleasing. They all look like an eyesore and I really just hate that. They do. So I haven't bought one yet because of that same reason. And the other day I went to a store and, oh, I bought some kitchen curtains that come today. I'm so excited to put them up tomorrow. Um, I went to a store the other day and I saw some really cute glass ones, but I already know those will break. Once you have those on the fire for a while, they're gonna break. And I feel like I also don't want a kettle that whistles. <laughs> Where did it stay? All right, well, it's eight o'clock. If I'm gonna make it a glass, I'm gonna have to hurry the hell up. I literally cannot be here doing all this stuff. I'm telling you, if I feel like I have a little bit of time on my hands, I'm screwed. Yesterday I made what I consider to be an omelet with like bits of bacon in there and that was amazing. So trying to make that again. Oh, we bought bacon bits. Are they gonna taste the same? It is very, very rare when I don't wash up as I go along because I'm telling you, I literally hate when there is like a load of everything in the sink. That's not my thing at all. Especially now that I have to wash so many dishes, I'm definitely gonna be washing as I go along. Um, today we're gonna actually start drawing blood. I think we're gonna use our classmates after um, the doctor demonstrates on the mannequin hand. The person who is lecturing us is a doctor, which is quite intriguing. I'm telling you, we've learned so much from that man. But um, yeah, uh, this is the last week and like two days left. And for the next five days, we're gonna be practicing drawing blood and doing an exam. But for the most part, we're, we're ready. Um, last night we got an email that or P or EKG certificates are ready. So that's great too. But um, for the most part, it's pretty much done. And this is what a typical morning looks like of me getting ready. I'm not doing my, so much to my hair and washing a whole sink of dishes. Nine times out of ten, if my man cooked, I'm going to be washing the dishes. Sometimes I'll like complain and he'll be like you know what all right whatever but I try not to take advantage of the fact that I know that if I complain he's gonna do it because that's not nice if you have an agreement hold up your end of it all right because you don't want people to not be in favor of you because you can't hold up your end of a bargain I think that's basically it for this vlog and if I don't come back well thank you guys for chilling with me this morning um while I get ready for PCT school Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next vlog. I gotta clean up around here, shower, get ready, and actually leave.